guys so i wanted to come to you with a quick video today um i had redone this notebook that i had got at walmart and it was on clearance for two dollars um it has this antique look and um i'm gonna turn it to the side here that's the back that's the, the spine of it and this is the top of it as you can see the color is like that mustard yellow or antique yellow and um i love the color and so what i decided to do was to um make this like a journey or a map notebook and um i love maps so i thought this was perfect so i end up getting the paper i think i got the paper from either hobby lobby or michael and I love the way that this looks because this looks antique and I love maps. And then I had these book corners here that I got from Hobby Lobby. And they were, at the time, there was clearance out. So I got them for like less than a dollar. And then the little rhinestones that I have here that's near my thumb, I had got from Walmart when they're only... 90 i think they're like 98 cents or 97 cents a pack and these this is the iridescent kind and so i thought that was perfect for what um the color is here and so i covered the front and the back the same here and i could have made this more antique looking by um distressing the sides but i didn't I didn't want to do that. I'll probably go back and do that later on if I feel like it. And then here on the inside, as you can see, I did the cover. And sorry for the focus. Um, I did the inside cover with another type of matte paper. And this one's a little bit more detailed and, and um, antique. And it has different type of matte papers on there. And then what I did since this is like a traveler's journal um or like you know just going places traveling the world i decided to have like stickers you know that shows um just traveling things for instance i think this is more like the paris type thing um theme and so I'm going to show you a few pages that I've done so far. Let me pull back. And let me focus again. Okay, so. This is how the paper look with, any, with no stickers on there. And then this says, um, up here it says, Life is an adventure, embark now. And it has um, the words in gold and with the map background on it and then here is the rest of that paper that's on the inside cover and here's a stamp and here is more map paper and stickers and these stickers are kind of thick i like them i got them from hobby lobby and they were half off and those are the paper studio um stickers here's more of the map paper and these stickers here I actually got from the Dollar Tree. These are wall stickers, but you can use them in your notebook. Here's another map sticker. Here's a here's a treasure chest or a trunk, traveling trunk. And look, it got the gold foil on it. Love it. Here goes another um sticker. And this sticker here was the one um it says, I think it was like London and Paris. And, you know, you can make a little map out of all the stickers if you put them on a the wall. <clears throat> I love this, the key. Like, I would think that like, this is a key to a mailbox or a hotel room or something. And here goes another map. And that says London. And there goes a stamp sticker. And so, you know, these stickers, are, they remind me kind of like the antique dickles, the air balloon. And another key. See, there goes the phone booth for like London.
Make those Paris. More stamps in the heart air balloon. There goes um, stamp, and this is a stopwatch. And so some of the pages, here is one where I covered the front and the back page, you know. And this is a map, it's just a little bit darker, and I love the color because it matches this. And then here's this. And then here's another page. I covered the front and some of the back. And then here is one where I just covered the front of the page. And see, here's some of the big stickers now that you would see from the um, that sticker pack from the Dollar Tree. Patriotia macarons. Here's some more stickers. This is New York. Okay, here's a London sticker. And then um, this is not the middle, but I love this paper here. This is all the names of um, Jesus. And um, I it's I covered the whole thing and then I split the middle here because I just wanted to to continue, as you can see how it continues piece, and so mm hmm, I love that. And then here's some more stickers. And so it's just decorating. And I think that's it. And then the rest of the pages, and see, it's black, it's blank. And so, um, yeah, this is just a super cool idea. And let me show you the back real quick. So this is the back covered, the back inside, and of course the back of the book. So I thought that this was a pretty neat idea. Um, I haven't seen anybody show this book before from Walmart. Like I said, it clearance out at $2 and um, I loved it. And I said, hey, it's, it's different antique. And this is how it looks, um, start to look when it gets a little bit uh, full and decorated before I write in there. But um, I thought this was an excellent idea. If you ever grab a book like this, if they still have it available and you're wondering what to do, this is a great idea. Um, like, comment, share, subscribe, uh, and let me know if you want to see, um, more videos like this, or if you, um, have an idea and you want to, you know, just post your link down so I could check it out. Awesome. Um, and you never know who you in inspire to do a notebook like this. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.